The most significant problem that your baby will have immediately after delivery and into the first days of life, being prematurely born, is problems around respiratory work. He's got to be able to breathe in order to bring oxygen into his body and to use it to send out to his cells. When the baby is in utero with mom, the placenta takes care of all the respiratory work. It doesn't actually breathe like our lungs do, but it allows for the gas exchange back and forth between the baby and the mother so that the baby's oxygen needs are met. At the time of delivery, the placenta is clamped and the ability to do respiratory work is lost. The baby has to do what we call first breath dynamics, has to be able to bring air into the lung, has to be able to open and inflate the lung and allow air to get down to the alveolus where it can be exchanged as a gas. The problem with our premature babies at 23, 24, 25 weeks is they have very, very limited lung function because they haven't developed all the organs in their lungs necessary to breathe, such as the alveoli, and more importantly, a substance called surfactant. Surfactant is a, a lipoprotein or a fat protein substance that our lungs make that enable them to stay open. If you think of your baby's lungs as a balloon, and, and when I talk to parents, I always make sure I have in my pocket a balloon. And if you think of trying to blow up either a long skinny balloon or a round fat balloon, the round fat balloon is usually easier. And that's sort of what the alveolus looks like. So it opens up. But the minute you quit blowing air into that balloon, it collapses back down. What surfactant does is it comes in and coats the inside of that alveolus structure and it helps it stay open so that the very next breath, the baby doesn't have to work as hard as he did for his first breath. Babies just begin to make surfactant at around 25 weeks. It's, it's way too little an amount for your baby to benefit from, so we give them artificial surfactant. We put that down an endotracheal tube into their airways we gently bag it down into their lungs so it gets down into the small conducting passages into the alveolus itself. And that helps stabilize the baby's lungs until he can make enough on his own. Your baby may require two or three doses of surfactant before he's able to get by without additional surfactant administration and can make enough on his own. This is called usually hyaline membrane disease or respiratory distress syndrome and it's the most common lung disease that we see in premature babies.